Hello everybody and welcome to this video where I want to show you something um, a little interesting that I've discovered in my my um, farming simulator 19 game that uh, has only been present since the last patch update um, and I've, 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 I've mentioned this um, this issue or this discovery a couple of times on other YouTube videos and on forums and things like that related to the game and people tell me I'm talking complete and utter rubbish um, but this video is going to prove I'm not talking complete and utter rubbish firstly let's go into the store let's go into our placeables menu and I just want to show you quickly that I'm not using any silo placeable mods okay none at all all my silos are the vanilla silos apart from the extended barn mod which accepts hay grass straw silage chaff um, TMR and wood chips that's all I have no other mods we can go in decoration all I've got is trees farmhouses I've only got this little trailer farmhouse sheds got no mod sheds apart from the mod hub ones animal pens there's nothing in there to do with mods none you know there's nothing in here nothing in here apart from Stevie's tree pallet for his cedar nothing so there's nothing to explain how this works so let's get in my tractor and as you can see I have currently in my trailer 4,235 potatoes potatoes now normally you can't store potatoes anywhere apart from dumping them on the ground there's nowhere in game to store root crops at the moment so potatoes sugar beet there's no no actual in-game storage it's just a case of you tip them on the floor and you deal with them when you deal with them same comes to sugarcane um, that has the same rules as well so we'll drive through this little area that I created on the map which has my silage silos it has my hayloft and then it has my grain silo so I've got my large grain silo and then I've got a bunch of silo extensions so if I drive around here now to the sell point what I will say is originally when I just had the large grain silo on its own nothing happened here it was only after I added the large extension as soon as I placed one large extension I encountered this start overloading potatoes but you can't tip potatoes at a grain silo everyone says you can't store potatoes at a grain silo everybody says well looks to me like I've just tipped potatoes into the grain silo oh well that's a bug people will say you, you won't be able to get your potatoes back from your silo they're lost okay let's go under here then 359,925 litres of potatoes and um, I can recover them from the silo Uh, let's take out the 59,000 litres of potatoes and see what happens when we go back into that menu. Take a long while to fill this trailer up because it's got a quite a large capacity. Right, so we've filled 60,000 potatoes. How many is left in the silo? 299,000. Well, what would you know? I can store potatoes in my grain silo. 
I'm not talking rubbish. And that's, as I say, this has only been since patch 1.2 landed that fixed the problem with crops going into the large silos and basically going into the other category in your menu and you've not been able to recover your crops from them and basically your crops being lost. And I, what I've discovered on other save games where I've yet to do, or should I say, I've yet to place a large silo extension, I can't drop potatoes or sugar beet. I can do sugar beet as well. I can't, I can't um, overload potatoes or sugar beets at the silo until I place an extension. As soon as I place an extension, hey ho, suddenly I can store absolutely everything. I mean, I haven't got, I haven't done sugar cane harvesting yet. Um, but I plan to. <laughs> and as soon as I've done sugar cane harvesting, I'm going to see if um, it will let me tip and store sugar cane in the silo too. I don't see why it won't if it's letting me do potatoes and sugar beet. And look, 533,820 because I've took 66,000 out. So yeah. Whether I've, I'm just somehow lucky <laughs> in the fact that my game has glitched to the point that it, it lets me do this. I don't know. I don't know rhyme or reason. As I say, I'm not using any storage mods. Apart from that hayloft. That one hayloft. Nothing that affects the vanilla game silos. And like I say, the only reason I the only reason I discovered it was because when I did my first potato harvest, I came through here because I was going to actually tip them back here in this back corner and it was as I drove over that grill over the silo that I got the overload message and the first time it came up I ignored it I was actually twitch streaming at the time and I ignored it and it wasn't until someone pointed out in the comment after I'd done a couple of because I was having to go and I was um um had to make a few obviously trips to unload the harvester um, to tip my potatoes into that silo that they said you do realize you, you you can the game says you can overload the potatoes at the silo so sure enough next time I brought my tractor through here to tip my potatoes over there I came over here the message popped up and I thought that's weird and I tried it, and sure enough, they tipped, and I thought, well, same as everyone else. Well, that's got to be a bug. I've just lost those potatoes. And then I came round here, and sure enough, they were in the silo, and I could get them back out. So then I had to get the conveyor, of course, because then I had to hoover up all the potatoes I've just unloaded back into the um, trailer so I could store them in the silo. And then someone said... Oh, I wonder if that works with sugar cane, uh, sugar beet as well. And I was like, hmm, have to give it a try. So I planted some sugar beet, and when it harvested, came and found I could tip it and store it in the silo. So my next plan, of course, then is to try um, um sugar cane, which is currently growing on field 18 on this map, and it'll be a while before it's um ready but as you can see i've got quite a lot of um crop <laughs> i've got a lot of storage because i've got lots of extensions i've got another silo as well over by my main farm if i find it pop out of here this is the silo that you get when the game when you start the game in new farmer mode the, the the one it gives you at the start so it's down here so that's the the new far, the new farmer map placed 
um, silo. So that one over there was a completely separate silo altogether that I bought. And onto this, I've obviously added two large extensions. And having placed those, I can tip potatoes and sugar beets at this one too. <laughs> so, yeah. Despite what people think, I'm not talking rubbish. You can clearly see in this video, I can store potatoes and sugar beet in the grain silo. And I assume once I've harvested my sugar cane, I'll be able to store that too. So thank you everybody for watching the video. And um, if I find any more crazy um, occurrences, in Farming Simulator 19, I'll be sure to make some more videos and post those too. So for now, from me, goodbye.